Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to my A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood movie review. If I had to describe this movie in one word, that word would be nostalgic. Um, I think this movie was uh, motivated, uh, or was, uh, how can I say this? this? This movie probably got greenlit after the success of the uh, documentary that came out last year. And I think investors or producers, studios, whatever you want to call it, kind of concluded that, oh, look, there's a lot of interest in this Mr. Rogers thing. Now, this movie is not a biopic about Mr. Rogers. This is about, this is more about a reporter who had a reputation for doing smear interviews and trying to, like, tarnish people's images. Um, uh, I think he worked for Variety, and they told him to go interview Mr. Rogers back, you know, I don't know, what, 20 years ago, something like that. And uh, it's more about how meeting him changed his life. Uh, Mr. Rogers is portrayed by Tom Hanks. He's probably going to get an Oscar nomination. I don't. He's not going to win. He doesn't deserve to win for this. He, uh, not to say he wasn't good. He deserves a nomination. He did an excellent job. And um, uh, the reporter is played by an actor named uh, Noah Harpster. I feel like I've seen him before, but I, I, I can't pinpoint where. And it's directed by Mario Heller, which I know nothing about. I didn't know who she was. She did a great job with this. But, you know... I, I don't know that Tom Hanks needs a lot of direction, especially when you've got, you know, you've got footage from uh, Mr. Rogers. This, this movie was heartfelt. It had a lot of soul. Um, it, you left the theater feeling warm and happy, positive. Everything that Mr. Rogers would have wanted you to feel. It, 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 everything that uh, that man wanted to uh, send out into the universe and into society. Um, I, I loved Mr. Rogers when I was a kid. I watched him every time that I could, every day. Um, I liked seeing how stuff was made. I liked his trips. I liked when he would go into Imagination Land. I liked Trolley. Um, and um, he was inspiring. And the sad thing is, I feel like if someone like him came around today everyone would start digging into his past and trying to destroy him because we don't, it's almost like we don't want something that's that pure and that's that's that good um, anymore um, which is sad so anyways um, I highly recommend this movie um, it's very nostalgic and I, I give it an, an 87 out of 100 uh, fantastic movie um Go see it. Watch it with your family. It's a great family film. Um, I think it's still playing in theaters. If it's not, it should be coming out on streaming. Um, it's a good rental. It's a, it's a good movie to go see. It's a great family experience, and I highly recommend it. Um, you leave the theater feeling very happy. Um, Mr. Rogers really was a very um, inspirational man. Um, he became a part of... Uh, American pop culture. I think he's an American icon, an American treasure. And I feel like I benefited from having watched him as a child. And um, he was on for so long that it, it, there were multiple generations of children that grew up watching him. And that same person that you saw on the TV show was the same person. Um, that was him. So it wasn't, he wasn't acting. Um, and I, I wish there were more people like that today. Um, anyways, leave your, uh, what did you guys think? Did you guys see it? Um, let me know what you guys thought. Leave your, mess, leave your uh, comments below. And uh, I will see you guys later, okay? Like and subscribe. Bye.